Hey, what's up guys? KCB Boy here, back with another ROM for your HTC One, and this is RGUI ROM, so let's go ahead and check it out. So RGUI ROM is a Sense-based ROM, so you still get all of the features of HTC Sense, like Blink Feed, Zoe, and everything else that you're used to seeing in Sense 5. And just like pretty much any other Sense ROM for the HTC One, it is running on the latest 4.2.2 update, so that's definitely good to see there. Since it is running on 4.2.2, this ROM is compatible with pretty much all variants of the HTC One except for the Sprint model, so just keep that in mind before flashing. I've been using RGUI for a few days now and it's definitely a pretty nice ROM. Performance has been very good, everything has been nice and smooth and I haven't noticed any sort of lag or slowdown whatsoever. I also haven't noticed any bugs either so it's definitely very stable and daily driver material. One of the things that I always look for in a ROM is how customizable it is, and RGUI definitely has a nice amount of customization. Now, it's not the most customizable ROM that I've ever used. I think that title belongs to Viper 1 ROM, which I also reviewed, but RGUI definitely has a pretty nice amount of customization to make it worth the flash. All of the customization options can be found in the built-in RGUI Kitchen app, which allows you to pick and choose exactly what you want to install. Here you'll find various mods, themes, font packs, kernels, and much, much more. Under the mod section, you can install items like the AOSP 4.2 camera, remove the boot sound, advanced power manager, etc. In the theme section, you can theme the sense clocks, weather icons, and system UI elements. You can also preview what they look like before you decide to download and flash the file. There is also a theme that was designed specifically for RGUI and you can choose to install the entire theme or just elements of your choice. You'll notice that this theme will give you a very clean white look across the entire ROM and I actually think it looks pretty good. You can even theme items like your dialer and the Sense keyboard which I actually think look pretty nice as well. To install any one of these mods just simply download and once it's finished boot into recovery and flash like any other zip. I personally use twerp so your steps might vary here depending on your recovery but just select install and look for the RGY folder. Once inside the folder select the zips you want to install and swipe to confirm. Once you're done just reboot and your mod should now be installed. And that's pretty much going to do it for this video guys so if you want to check out this ROM I will leave a link to it down below in the description and as always if you enjoyed this video and found it helpful don't forget to click that like button for me down below and subscribe as well for more videos and once again thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.